Hi everyone, today we're going to be showing the X9 IP camera tester. This tester is a great tool for any installer to have in their toolbox. You can test AHD, TVI, CVI, and any IP camera. It features an 8 inch retina touchscreen display and it powers an IP camera with its onboard 48 volt PoE power output. This is going to be a short video just showing the cable testing features of this product and some other features that were not shown in our introduction video. So as this unit is booting up, uh, I'll just talk a little bit about the short demonstration which we're going to show today. It's more about the operation uh, of the cable testing aspect and cable toning aspect of this IP camera tester. Now a lot of people ask, you know, what kind of uh, cable testing can this unit do? So. The first section we want to go into is cable tester and the first test we're going to do is your standard cable tester. So once we hit that, now it's going to show us a screen here and a lot of people ask, you know, which female RJ45 port do I plug the cable into? Well, there's a connection diagram button here. If we click that, it's going to tell us to plug it into the UTP scan. So I'm going to go ahead and plug a cable into the UTP scan. And the unit also comes with a wand. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the wand on. And then I'm going to plug this uh, other end of the cable into the UTP scan female um, jack on the wand. As soon as I plug the cable in, it's going to tell us the cable type whether it's a straight through cable, uh, crossover cable, it's going to tell us if we have any twisted pairs. Uh, in this case it's showing us that the cable is a straight through cable and all pairs are good. So for our next cable test we're going to take this out and we're going to back up on the IP camera tester. And we're going to go to an RJ 45 TDR test. Now, this this uh, this cable tester is going to tell us uh, the length of the cable and the attenuation of the cable. Uh, again, connection diagram. It's going to tell us to plug it into the LAN port. So I'm going to go ahead and plug one end of the cable into the LAN port and the other end I'm going to plug into the wand itself. Now at this point we're going to click the test once button and the cable has to be over I believe 25 uh, meters in order to give us the attenuation it will tell us, tell us if it's a good quality cable, poor quality cable or a wet cable. But we can see the length in meters, it's telling us that it's an 8 meter long cable. So it's good if you want to know the cable length. And then the final test here, we are going to do a cable search and use the wand here. And this, we actually have to plug it into the UTP scan port. When we do that, we can use the wand and tone out a cable. And we can change the tone as well. So that'll, that will give you an idea as to how the cable testing function works.